guys, it's Way Love again. Um, decided to play some classical music while I'm doing this video. Hope you can hear me over it. Um, so, what was I going to say? Sorry, I'm having a little brain fart here. Oh, um, I'm currently doing this, you know, on the webcam. Obviously, it's not as good, good quality. Um, but I'm hopefully going to be working on the site to see if I can steal the computer from my mom for today. But, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the videos from Taco Bell and all that that I'm uploading, like, right now. Um, really, I'm trying to make videos just to entertain you until we can do some site-related events. Um, so far the calendar looks like, um, tomorrow, I believe, November 17th. We're going to be going to my grandmother's uh, grave slash Cadillac Cemetery. That's the cemetery she's at. Um, we're going to walk around there a little bit. I don't know if Chris is going to be coming with me or not because he doesn't really like cemeteries much. But um, just figured um, I know some people in the pagan perspective uh, look for them in my subscribedness. I'm subscribed to them. Um, they were talking about ancestry type stuff, like ancestor, not really worship, but like honoring your ancestors or whatnot. Um, so I know they were talking about that, and that's kind of why I want to go to my grandmother's grave, because one, I missed Salad working that day. Two, I missed her birthday. Her birthday was November 2nd. Um, so hopefully before my birthday, <laughs> we'll get there. Um, also, um, actually, after this video, I'm going to be calling the owner of Earthlore, a uh, little shop in Plymouth. It's a spirituality shop. They carry everything from, um, these huge, beautiful posters, or not like posters, like plaques of the Last Supper, um, for any Christians that happen to be watching, or Catholics, or I don't know who would be more interested in that. Maybe the same. I don't know. I, I wasn't really that religious when I was Christian. <laughs> um... But, um, they have everything from that to, um, actually I got my little Buddha there. I don't know if I showed you guys my Buddha or not. No, I'll show you guys my altar sometime soon. Um, but they have Buddhas, they have, um, they have, pic they have a, um, it was, I think, Pan and Psyche. They have big statues of, like, Pan and Psyche, the God, 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 God and Goddess, you know that. Um, they have the Millennium, I think it's Millennium, Millennium, uh, Gaia statue, which is really cool. She's all green, her hair looks like, um, vines with a bunch of, um, butterflies and such, butterflies and a bunch of animals in her hair, and she's got, I think she's got the moon on one breast, um, she's got something else on the other breast, and then she, the, her stomach look at me using my hands like you can see my belly, right? But, um, her stomach is the world, you know, the earth. And that's actually the one that I want. Um, if you search Gaia statues, it'll come up. You'll see it. Um, Google that, you know. Google, Google. Um, but they have those. They have almost a whole wall of incense. Huh. Um, they have, um, 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 they have dream catchers. They have a wall of books. They have this big, they have a thing of, I think it's smoky quartz that's probably bigger than my dog. And Lucy's not very small. She's not very big, but she's not very small. They have, as she starts snoring, nice. Um, it's probably bigger than she is. Actually, they have a thing of amethyst. It's probably bigger than my three-year-old nephew. So, I'm going to show you those. They also have a cat. They have a cat. Uh, I think it's Leo. Yeah, Leo. Angus was the one. Uh, rest his soul. Um, he was at the Livonia um, Earth Lore, which I will hopefully also be showing you. That's the smaller one. That's why I want to show you the Plymouth one first. Also, I think the owner works there, so I want to see if I can get an interview with the owner. Um, I don't remember his name. 
But I've met him before. He's a really nice guy. Kind of cute, actually, for an older gentleman. Well, not really older, but still. He's... He's a good guy. Like, he's really nice. Um... They have... More bumper stickers <laughs> with goofy things on them. They have one that says... That I personally want to get, but it'd probably ruffle a few feathers, considering the people across the street have one that says, There's only one God, quit trying to... Quit trying to fill his position or something like that. Um, it probably ruffle a few feathers because it says, uh, I'm against the death penalty, look what happened to Jesus. You know, those type of things. I also have one that says, Born Again Pagan. They have one that, that Chris wants that says, What would Scooby do? Um, I could go with that one. Um, I have one that's on my door. I, I gotta show you guys my door. The door to my room has a bunch of, um, a bunch of their bumper stickers. One says, don't look, don't make me release a flying monkey. Um, the A Wizard of Oz joke. Um, uh, well-behaved women seldom make history. I forgot who that was. That's a quote there. They also have these things called bits of wisdom. I have them on my wall. I keep every one that I get. Well, almost every one. I think I have one in my wallet, actually, that I need to put on my wall. But, um, they're just little sayings. Like, um, one was something like, he who whittles away himself to the whims of others winds up with nothing, or something like that. Something to that effect. Pretty much, if you keep, um, if you keep, uh, be, trying to be what everyone else wants you to be, you're not going to be anything, you know. Um, well, not that you're not going to be anything, but you, you get the point. I'm rambling. But, um, hopefully I'm going to take you there. That's probably going to be either, um, the 23rd or the 24th, um, because 25th, I believe. Right? Wait, what's my calendar? 25th is Thanksgiving? Right? Right? Yes. Um, or we may be going, um, on the 30th, which is my 21st birthday. Woo! But, um, even if we don't go then, there's still going to be a video. Um, I also may take you guys to the Bean. Um, it's the Plymouth Coffee Bean Company. It's a little amazing coffee shop. It's right down the road. Um, so we're going to take you there. They have the best green apple smoothies ever. It tastes like, if you guys have ever had the green chewy sweet tart, it tastes like that. Amazing. Um, they also have a thing, I think they still have it right now, called an apple chider. If you like chai, if you like chai lattes or chai or whatever, and you like apple cider, you're going to love this. It's an amazing, amazing drink. But, um, it's pretty much just a chai latte with apple cider. I can make it at home, but oh my god. <laughs> Do I have access to chai for one? And two, the atmosphere there, they have open mic night, they have, um, they have bands come in, they have free Wi-Fi as long as you, you know, buy one, at least one drink. It's a one drink minimum to chill there. They used to be open 24 hours, but then homeless people, like, I actually know someone personally that would stay there overnight because they didn't have anywhere else to go. But, um, yeah, so that's what I have planned. Um, I'm trying to get some other ideas from night. Um, if you guys know Knight on the site, Knight Silverwing, I believe, is her username. I'm going to try and get some, get in touch with her. I haven't talked to her much at all since I stopped my D&D game. But hopefully we will get something together and going. Um, I may, in an hour or so, be taking a trip to the park with Lucy and hopefully Chris. Um, so we'll see. But, um... That's about it for me right now, because I gotta go do dishes. Like, that, that's my life. I work, I post on the site, I play video games, and I do dishes. You know, if I'm not on front of I'm doing dishes. Or at work. So, um, I will talk to you guys later. Uh, have a nice night, and bless me.